And now, our feature presentation. Alrighty boysies, how you doing? How you doing this fine, fine day? We're coming to you live from Industrial Man Home Video Store. That's right boys, we're digging back into Dark Cloud. Let me just get the audio right because, again, the audio is different for each game I fucking play, so... What was I playing yesterday? That's not a good sign that I can't remember what I was playing yesterday. That was it, it was Tenshu of Fatal Shadows. So I, last time on Dark Cloud we finished Matataki Village in the Wise Old Forest. We gained a new party member in... What's his name? What's your boy's name? Uh, Goro? Which I, I read up why we weren't doing damage to the boy, the big... Uh, it, basically, there's an axe that you can get in one of the extra dungeons. And because I didn't get that, I wasn't doing damage to the boss. So, I, Oh, you're back from Amsterdam? Oh, how was Amsterdam? Did you enjoy yourself? Oh, it's Kiwi. What? So, I have, uh, came to this village, and supposedly this village isn't a big fan of humans. I mean, I can't blame them. We are kind of monsters. Who are you? I'm Mikey. Oh, it's that different from here because it's been miserable here the last week or so. Right, let's pop up here. Let's see. I have no clue where I'm going, so I'm just gonna. I'm probably gonna go into the center house. That's probably where the game wants me to go, but. Oh, humans! Can I ransack your house while I'm here? You only left on Monday morning. Ah! Yikes, who the heck are you? Well, it's still been miserable. So was it just Monday morning? Got up at 4am, I'm sometime, which is 3am. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'll be crashing soon. Oh, this is the house. This is the exact same house I was in. Oh, I just went around the circle there, boozies. Right, let's hop down here and then try and get to the centre of the village. Yep, got class tonight. Take a wee nap, maybe beforehand. Right, that's broke. Oh no, don't talk to me. Oh, it's okay. It's okay, I thought we crashed there first and I shot myself. It's okay, Mikey's head's empty. No damage was done there. Whoa, bingo, first try. And look at... Look at it! Like, it's boring, kinda. What do you, uh, what do you do with this? What, me, or...? So, you've come around. What does a human want in a place like this? The Dark Genie? What's that? It's no use talking nonsense. I'm sure sticking, uh, I'm sure sticking your head under the water will help you reconsider playing the fool. Oh Jesus, I'm getting tortured. It's like a GTA 5 scene. Nem! What? This person seems to be telling the truth. Crystal has. Please, just come. Is this just before they get the fucking car battery and nipple clamps out? Here we go. Burr clunk. Oh, so now seeing the dark genies here. I wonder if that's the fortress they're gonna be invading at the end of the game. I wonder. I bet I'll get to like the like the level just before you fight the boss, and my good weapon breaks. Money on it. That's what's gonna happen. Oh, he's a big boy. So he is. Wait, is that a cigar in his gub? So he's got this apocalypse weapon that's just woken up. Why not just attack things now? Oh, maybe he just wants to smoke a good cigar in the meantime. Hmm, I feel a tremendous power. This must be the Dark Genie. That, uh, that the guy was talking about. This is the, e is this the evil Genie of Darkness, our ancestor sealed? Probably.
What? You're telling us to seal that thing again? No way, never. We could never seal that monster. Not with the ability we have now. Theo's right. Magic is indeed the secret power the moon people have passed on throughout the generations. But as we lived in this land for so long, we seem to have lost that ability. We just don't have the power to seal the genie anymore. It doesn't mean that it's impossible though. Well, what do we do then? There are no moon people left here who can still use magic, but if you go to the moon, there should definitely be those that can. Exactly, you're right. We need to go to the moon. As, as you do, just gotta go to the moon. People in uh, Brown Boo have always prepared for this day to return. We have a ship to take us to the moon. Excuse me? Hidden in a particular place. What? Can we really do such a thing? It's okay. We won't use it for a while anyway. Bring the moon orb here. Roger. The orb of the moon is a sphere to move the moon ship. With the orb, you can remotely control the moon ship from anywhere. Well boys, we're away to the moon. Oh no, the moon orb is missing. What do you mean? Does anyone know where the orb is? Nem, sir, the other day, Joska went uh, to Queens to sell the moon fruits. Could it be that it was accidentally mixed together with the moon fruits? Joska, yes? Do you know about the moon orb? Ah, now that you ask, I do remember a strange colored fruit among the others. That must be it. How could you do that? I'm so sorry, Chief. Hmm. So I guess we gotta go to Queens and find the moon orb. Here's what you can't let you use a moon ship. Without the moon orb, we cannot operate the moon ship. Say, why not go to Queens and find the orb? Oh, that's a good idea. You can find the orb on your own, then we'll operate the moon ship. These kind of things uh, should be done by oneself, I suppose. And you return it after you're done with it. With them doing all of the work, what are you doing? Now, I'll mark Queens in your map so you can go there. You better get moving soon. Off you go. I just want us to fuck off at the village. So, right, Monte Queens, boys. Go to other area. Right, where's Queens at? Just pop up in the middle of fucking New York City. That's where Queens is, right, isn't it? Right, what's the city of Queens or the town of Queens? Oh, was that a city? Man, this place looks pretty big. Getting a big near sort of... Like, you know the town in near, the sort of seaside one? Getting a big bang of that right now. But look how empty this place is. I know that's the, I know that's the gimmick that you fill it up. Because everyone's sealed up in Atla, but... It's massive. Actually, can I just do this? Look at how big these areas are, holy shit. Right, where do you have to go, boys? Where it looks like where it looks like somewhere that in here maybe. Maybe up here. Oh please don't tell me that's uh fucking PS2 seagulls. I've got real seagulls nesting outside my house and I can't deal with it. Maybe on the beach or Oh, here we go, we got a cutscene. Class. Oh, there's someone there. The one man left in Queens. Oh, you. So there are other humans left other than myself? I thought I was the only one left in this whole wide world. Good to know there's someone, even though you're just a kid. I'm Randall. I sell goods here in Queens, and you? So you're Mikey? Oh, we don't have to we don't have to stand here talking. Why don't we go to, over to my shop? Oh wait, Randall's got a shop? Class. So I'll probably need to build it first. Oh wait, no, that was fully, fully equipped, I think. Look at this massive table, fucking hell. What, they brought that fat beast back to life? Bulls, they must be from the east. Oh my god. We're up to some madness again, those blasted Easterners off. Oh, we're getting into racism, boys, oh no. Fantasy racism, Jesus. Uh, uh, blood sucking scum of the earth. Even back then. 
Damn. Jonathan, that's it with Jonathan has heard their summon word and racism and they've just been brought in. Everyone pissed and now making needs a piss. Oh dear. Forget how Jason set that up. Absolutely fucked it. That's your fault, Jonathan. Ruined my nightbot. And what's this minor that you're looking for? I mean, I see. Maybe it's in the undersea treasury. It's a shipwreck at the bottom of the Queen Sea. Most merchants in Queen's use it as a warehouse. Why? But it's changed lately. Now there are monsters everywhere. That giant monster that attacked Queen's must be the cause. Today it's so dangerous, it's such a dangerous place that we can't even go to get our merchandise. Do you still want to go there? All right, I'll help you. Come follow me. I don't know if this Bobby Randall is going to be our new party member. He doesn't look the most, you know, party member. -y. Like, he just looks like a sort of generic NPC. This Queen's a town of merchant traders. Uh, some items we handle are really very expensive. Such expensive items need special care and handling. The safest place to keep such items here in Queen's is... It's kind of a huge safe at the bottom of the sea. But you're wondering why that ship sank there, aren't you? Oh fuck, here we go. It was about 100 years ago. The Queen was reigning over... The Queen reigning over Queen's passed away. What was it called before that? What about the King? And that was when our townspeople who adored the Queen sunk her favourite ship along with her. That's the wrecked ship at the bottom of the sea, or, the sea near Queen's. The Seer? Can I fucking talk? When Queen's revived as a merchant town, the late Queen sunken ship started to serve as an undersea treasury. Doesn't sound like the best idea, to be honest. Sounds a bit disrespectful, but merchants are practical. They make the best of any situation. Don't you have a treasury, you know, above the, uh, like above the sea? What? How you gotta get there? Oh, I've got a submarine boozies, let's go. Take a look at that. This is a submarine turtle. That makes trips to and from the shipwreck. Why do now was Astalon, whatever it is. Astalon agent of piss or whatever. This is what the merchants use to raid and store valuable items in the treasury. There, it's all yours. And it only carries one person, so you have to go alone. How do you operate it? It's easy, you just get in and it'll take you to the shipwreck. It was designed for merchants who know little about machines and are only good at counting money. I'll be in my store, so stop by if you didn't. My store carries a lot of stuff. Oh, and I'll give you a hand, but I'll have to charge you for the goods. Even at a time like this, merchant is a merchant. We're literally the last two people in this place. Take care. Literally the last two people alive and he's just worried about... Right, where's his shop? Because after that fight with the Forest Guardian, yeah, my supplies have taken a bit of a beating. I need plenty of food and I need plenty of repair powder. And maybe a weapon if he's got one. Can I shop here? Ah, if you need something, why don't you buy it here? I mean, I've not got much of a choice anywhere. Buy two of these, or three of these actually. Auto repair powder. Just buying a shit ton of repair powder. Uh, what's that? Set as an active item. All repairs when weapons are about to break. Couple of them. And fill up on cheese. And repair powder. There we go. I've got too many items. Good problem to have. And I realise I'm not going to have enough for the keys, am I now? Wait, you know what we'll do? We'll make a wee save and Lily's barking at something. Oh, it's the... It's the postman. Ah, I can... She loves the postman when the door's not in the way. Right, here we go. Raid the submarine. Let's have a wee gander at the new layout. See how it is. I wonder if everyone's going to be like water based, like I'm going to have to use the lecky thing. Also boys, I have never made it as far. I have only ever made it as far as the second world or second dungeon.
So I'm really looking forward to this. I'm really enjoying Dark Cloud so far. I've got a feeling it might overstay its welcome a little bit in the end. But overall, still fucking loving the game so far. Right, so here we go. We're in the sunken shipwreck. Oh, this music's fucking class. Then again, it's level 5. Level 5 always have class music. Like the soundtracks and uh, and the Presser Layton are really good. And I've never I've never actually played like White Knight Chronicles or uh, the Nino Kuni spin-offs to then. Actually I've never played Nino Kuni. I probably should get to that. I like how we're going up. Oh, that's kinda cool. I was hoping it would start like it would tell you like, layer eighteen or layer seventeen, yeah. And you'd be working your way. But whatever. Right, layer one, what's the What's the gimmick here? What do I need to... Gunny. It's a gunny. Oh, boys, if, this, if everyone's, like, water-based... I've just clicked. What if there's a jellyfish anyway, boys? I can't, I can't be doing this. Right, there we got some taken care of. One gunny down. Let's grab some atla. What have we got? Give us some good. A lamp. Take that. Right, here we go. What have we got? Give us some... Tree. Class. Right. What's in here? Pumped with energy. Yes, man. Get me pumped. Oh, no. No. Fuck. Ah, the serpent sword broke. I was already in a combo when I realised it was low. Fuck. Ah, that's bad. I think I'll, I'll use a wise old sword now, I think. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I got a road, road acquired. What I'll do is... Oh, that was upsetting. I'm sure it was full. Just before I died, but... There we go. I know the, I know the game's built around it. It's the same way in uh, Tears of the Kingdom. Ah, I'm not a fan of weapon degradation. I know it's meant to be with survival elements and stuff like that, but I'm just not a fan of it. It's it's kind of like whenever I see a hunger bar in the game, it's like, oh fuck, here we go, you know. Right, and what's down here? Man, these maps are big. A bit of, so it's a bit of break. Let's give it a wee heal, and I shall get myself a wee drink as well. And I'll set one of Dran's feathers there, so I can keep up with the... Right, here we go, here we go, boys. I can't believe I think I drink when there was a, fu a fucking puddle just formed. It. Not a puddle, a bit of water just formed. Wait, who are you? Skeleton boy. Carcia? I don't know if that's an A or an O. I mean, the good thing is I'm not dropping items, so it seems like I can just run through this. Better grab some water. What I'll do is I'll. Give everyone a wee heal. I think I think everyone's got the same walking speed. I'm not quite sure or running speed, I'm not quite sure. Right, 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 I'm just gonna grab whatever I can. What have we got? Ship cabin key. I need to catch I need to try and catch up damage wise, so I'm gonna try and kill all the skeletons and shit that I can't. Oh no. Damage wise, that's okay. Attack plus one acquired. Let's let's add that to the wise owl sword. Equip, right, customize. Attack. Is it like water buster or something like that? or plant buster, wind, 
gem can be attached to I don't know what it does, but I'm sure we'll find endurance. There we go. And then when it upgrades, it'll be even more powerful. And I'm poisoned as well. Luckily, I've got a shit ton of antidotes. And I'll... A pair of sword. And I've got the auto powder, but I don't quite trust it yet. Let us fly through here. When did I get a map? Oh, never mind from one of the never mind. Right, and the exit's right in front of me. I'm I'm not gonna use it, I'm just gonna see if Is it a door? Right, it doesn't seem to be, but I'll Rusty Keyhole use the ship cabin key. And what's the gimmick here? It's filling with water. Am I hearing things? I hear whistling. Well, of course, I'm not going to think I can use it yet, but... I can find it absolutely mental that I've done the whole segment in the first the first whole sort of, you know, Divine Beast cave. And did I find something? Did I fuck? And then down this way. There we go. Right, give me some Atla. Oh, Atla. And what have we got here? What have we got here? Give me some tasty. Endurance plus one. Ah, I'll do. I wonder how much I'm getting from like each skeleton. Let's have a gander. Ah, it's doing not bad. It's about to, about to get upgraded. What's this? Hook. Oh. That's what I'll need to get a hook so I can actually, like, stand on the hook. I thought I could just run through everything, but supposedly not. That'd be too easy, you know? Right, I'll fight the enemies after, I'll... That's a, do that's a wall, Mikey. You can't run through a wall. Oh, there's a lot of Atla in here. Attack plus one. I just used one of them up, so... Actually, I'll give a shit ton of attack ones to Zhao, because I want Zhao to be like a fucking machine gun, you know? A push cart full of fish. A treasure key. Ah, the, the coward's way out. I want to guess every single time. Of course. Get it right at the end. A lamp. Oh boy. I love lamp. Right, uh... So, right, take take the crab down first. I don't want to test the theory on the auto. I might get like a, a bad weapon and try it out with that. Just to see if it if that's how it works. So I don't want to risk losing one of my good weapons. Actually, how much am I getting now? So it was 40 last time and that was me killed two enemies. 52, so. Yeah, well, next floor it should be able to upgrade. There's a pulley that seems to have some function, and I'll just use the hook. Attach the uh, pulley to the hook. That's a massive fucking hook. I just had that in my pocket. Fucking hell. You can use this to go to upper level. I'm kind of glad we've got we've left uh, that gimmick, you know, where it's you have to get like the three items that are random, you know. Go to the next floor, might as well just keep going. I'm, so I don't think I'm going to finish the shipwreck today, but I'm going to try my best to get as far through it as possible. Maybe even into the double digits of layers. But again, we'll see how it goes. I will get to the point where the story starts for a dungeon, because it tends to be like quiet for the first while and then a little bit of story happens and then like a new member joins your party and then it's just straight into the boss, you know, after you finish the town. Oh, that's about a break as well. I just got poisoned. That's goo. I got good. Do I have any soap for the goo? I do not have any soap for the goo. 
We've got Revival Powder. Standing Powder, as if I die. I'll heal myself with some cheese and some Repair Powder. Goo just affects how your movement, doesn't it? Cursed Rose. There we go. Man, the damage that I think takes off your repair powder is like ridiculous. So I've not got any I've not got any soap to wash the goo off. So I guess I'm just sitting here covered in goo. A wee gooey boy. I mean it'll wear off eventually. Right, uh, enemies like Oh, it's a blogging sound, I hate that. Right, one combo. There we go. Oh, I can upgrade my sword. Let's do that now. Upgrade. I wonder what AGM does. Attack plus one. Yeah, let's give it a holy and give it fire. Why not? Attribute wind and holy. Enemies against wind. This, I mean, we'll give it the the holy because there's some skeletons cutting about. I don't know what the the plant's obviously fire, but the crab maybe a lecky. That's my Pokemon brain, but I forget I shouldn't trust my Pokemon brain when we're playing. Okay, that deletes those enemies. Holy shit! I'm playing RPGs because look at Shin Megami Tensei, who you'll you'll meet an enemy who's like, oh. I've got fire on me, but they're actually weak to, like, lightning or whatever, you know? My god, when's this goo effect gonna wear off? Like, that's, that, that, uh, stabbed me a lot in Pokemon, because they'd be like, oh, look, it's, we're fighting Thor, maybe wind, I don't know. Maybe, and then suddenly, you know, he'd cunt you with something. Like, you'd be like, oh, he's weak to fire, of course. That's the exit. Cool. Oh my god, I've been good. It's taking so long. Duh. I don't want to use up that item. It's like a cure all. Goes to all, all conditions. Don't want to do that. Anyway, to get rid of goo. Skate powder, standing powder. What? Oh, wonder if I change character. Are they good? They're not good. Here we go, here we go. And the feather's such a... Such a lifesaver item. We could be here a wee while, but you know what? Yes, man. Just get this... Rose scalped. Right, was that the only enemy here? I'll go get the treasure chests and then I'll come back and do the... Oh! The skeleton! I think Shell might be the best character so far, apart from that... Hey! Hey! Sound which does when she attacks. That just goes fucking through you. Got a map. There's a whole bit up there that I've not explored. We got a carrot, I'll sell that. Because I've not really touched the fish in many games. Oh, I probably should have done that right. I was right next to that la. I got a spout. And what's in here? What have we got? A bicycle. I'm just getting all the shade, the, the shade, side shit, the now. I tried to say those two words at the same time, but I said shade, which isn't a word. Right, here we go, here we go, we got this. So I could, uh, no, I couldn't exit now, I've not got a hook, do I? I can use some soap. I've never wanted that guy in the bath to appear, but I do now, right, here we go. 
I got some holy water, which I think works like a throwing item against enemies that are weak to holy. If you were, if you had a weakness, why would you carry it around with you? Ice gem, I'll sell a couple of them because I got quite a few of them. Premium water. Oh god, here we go. Got some of that smart water. I, mean, I remember everyone drank that for like six months. Ah, you bastard, you wasn't paying attention. It was like six months where that's all people would drink and shit. And now it's, yeah. I don't even think it's a thing anymore. Right, there we go, there we go. Right, and what have we got? We've got some Atla here. I think that's... No, it's not all enemies. Those. Fuck. Bag is full. Well, let's make some space, because I'm going to use some repair powder. But when you head out after this level, because I'm running low on repair powder, and I'll sell all the shit I don't need. Tasty water. Let's switch to you. I'll need to buy some soap as well, just to wash off the goo. Mikey's a gooey, manky boy right now. Here we go, Joel. Just get running, get sprinting. And right, what have we got here? We've got a gunny. Let's see how much damage do you do. Ah, it's not bad. So about five shots will kill a gunny. There we go. What have we got? Oh, it's the hook. You know what? I'll fight it. I'll take down these boysies first. And there's a cursed rose up there. Let's just get this guy scalped. And one more should do it. Class, there we go, right. Uh, I need to make some room. What's a throw? What throw an item have I got that I can use? I'll get. I should probably sell for a lot. Uh, what do I not need? Oh, one of the, I've got a lot of holy water. Been some holy water, so I can get the hook to escape. And let's get right beside the Atla. And then change over to Mikey. Mikey's still all gooey. I've got Joker. Uh, I don't know why I should make a Batman reference or a Persona reference, but we got we got him. We got Joker. Everyone's favourite. Watermill, there we go. Right, here we go, here we go. Just gotta get sprinting and we're heading up. Here we go. Nearly there. Come on, Joe. You can make it. Don't know why I'm saying you can make it. It's not as if we're under any sort of poison or anything like that. Right, so if I use the hook, which... Oh, no, it's holy water used. There we go. There's the hook. And what we'll do is we'll leave dungeon temporarily. We'll sell some stuff. Buy some more repair powder, buy some soap for Mikey so he's not a gooey, gooey boy. Wait, where's the... There, there we go. I was just heading to the shop. And I'll do... I'll, what I'll do is I'll wait and I'll do like bulk sort of building. Buy some goo. Uh, buh, buh, buh. Probably gonna regret selling them. Grass cake grows defense. I'll give that to Goro. Right, what do I not need here? Oh, repair powder, tasty water. Ah, I can't buy that. I can't sell the manual. Oh, sell the two uh, fishing things. 
I probably should give the, the fishing things away. Well, not give them away, but you know, like, not fishing. I meant to say give the manual and the fishing rod away. I'll do that now, actually. What I'll do, because I'll forget to do it in a bit. But first, we're going to clean Mikey of his gooey subs. Never mind. He's not a gooey anymore. Who said they could carry stuff for me? Was it. I think it was in Mataki Village. I could. Uh, which got. It was. Oh, fuck. What's that thing's name? The big uh, orca thing. No, it's not an orca. The whale type creature. Couscous. There we go. Couscous said he could keep items for me. So let's just drop some items off with Couscous. I got a gourd. Can I check in some items? Uh, check in the fishing rod and the manual. There we go. Plant buster. Yes, man. What was... There was another item. So how's the world lately? Is Baron still the mayor? Anything new? Everyone's fine, pal. Don't need to worry about it. Let's give the gourd to... Mikey certainly doesn't need it. Give it to yourself. I need to find somewhere to drink. But I don't think I can do it in the dungeon. Like, anywhere that's not a dungeon. But I bought everyone, so we'll head straight to Sh Ashna. We'll save here. I'll be really confused if I load it and I'm in the Mataki village. Go to other area and we're gonna head straight to the shipwreck. I might need to do some drinking before because I think Mikey's pretty thirsty. Right, right into the shipwreck, let's fucking go. Just call me Jim Cameron. Mind when that, that uh Titanic thing happened and Jim Cameron just went, oh well. Basically, it was a skill issue. I'm stealing that part of a Kieran, but I seen this thing on TikTok, uh, Jason actually shared it, it was like, and it was someone uh, on TikTok and it was making memes in GTA about, uh, about that bridge thing that, and they were just saying, imagine what it'd be like if like TikTok was about when like all these other disasters happened, like, oh my god. Like the whole Titanic thing, and, like TikTok was nothing but just memes about the Titanic crash, for, or not crash, but you know what I mean. Oh god, right, here we go. Attack plus two. Oh, that's really useful. Oh, my sword. No, I'm locked on a combo. Do I risk seeing if the auto thing works? I don't want to risk it. I've already fucked a good sword. And the gunny takes off so much. I'm probably better t uh, taking on the gunny with Zhao because I don't lose as much. You know what, I'm going to start using bombs. Fuck okay, let's give it a try. Well, I'll wait until there's actually an enemy there before I throw a bomb. A flapping fish. Oh, a ship cabin gear is useful. Right, and let's get the Atla. Here we go, boys. It's the thing is, boys, I find the sort of... The repetitive nature is kind of cosy. Because you can't just go on, pick up Atla, pick up treasure chest and just head on to the next floor. It's strangely... Strangely cosy, you know? Oh, fuck me, the bombs might... Boys, I think I might have been an idiot and just not used bombs because the bombs actually might be pretty good. Water surface. Let's take out the gunny first. Okay, let's try that with Zhao. Yes, a much better idea because I'm not actually damaging my weapon as much. 
and this is easy because it's got the slowest moving projectiles in the world. There we go. Oh! I can upgrade my bandit sling slot. Sling slingshot? I can't fucking talk now. Plus eight. Plus nine. Oh, nearly at plus ten. I wonder if I actually change its look at plus ten. I got a road. Yes, man. I think, like, roads are... Roads and water... That's the thing, because the water actually... Like, rivers keep taking... Like, they were important in the first... No, the second one, because you had to, you know, bring the... That tree some water. But they don't seem super useful in these ones, you know? Like the roads don't see un unless you want to curse cannot change equip weapon oh that's what curse is I forgot I was playing as Mikey and I just dived right into it. some tasty water you know what? let's get Mikey some XP I just realised how weak Mikey is Oh fuck. Well, I was a risky boy there. And does holy water remove curse? It does. Oh, well, would you look at that? Not that I plan on changing my weapon, you know? I think curse would get you in a very specific position. Like, you're like, oh, boys, I've not, I like, I'm not going to repair powder and my really good swords on, like, two hits of, you know. Two hits of damage or whatever. Wait, there's one Atlas through there. A bunch of enemies. Right, let's make our way. Let's... Well, there's one I meant like on the right side. There's like a bunch of. There's like one Atla and a bunch of enemies, but. You know what? We'll switch to Zhao. Is it Gunny down here? Oh, I'm gonna need to upgrade soon. I don't want to risk losing my plus 10. I... I know I've got the auto one equipped, but I don't want to risk losing my fucking plus 10. Wait, where's the grass cake? We'll give it. Just to use up, right. There we go, go. I'm also going to try and get her defense up. I wonder if she's got an item where she can do that. I got... Eevee? Heavy? I'm not quite sure what that said. It's okay, I've... Plenty of soap boozies. Can wash all my nether regions. And I got a map. Some, I'm, I'm fucking swimming in soap boozies. Just change over to Mikey for a second. And what have we got? Stew. Yes, man. Right, uh... Let's just run up this way, and... Again, thank God for a Dran Feather. Holy shit, this makes everything so much easier when you're going through dungeons. Right, and there's two boozies here. There's a... Skeleton boy. I'm just going to try and focus on getting the slingshot to plus 10. I've got a hook. Just stay out of reach for the gunny. I don't know if, don't know if it's got any range moves apart from the spit and poison, but that might just be from the cursed rose. Must be because devil there's one there. I'm sure a gunny poisoned me before. Just sit slightly out of range and... There we go. Skelped. What have we got here? What's what's wanting to fuck? Oh, a skeleton. Right there, we go. Skeleton taken care of. Yes, man. And let's trade over to you. And Mikey's got a oh fuck me a prison. I don't know why I'm a, I was a bit taken aback by a prison being something that we've got. 
like usually in fantasy games, it's either like you know like Oblivion that tries to be a, or not Oblivion, like Elder Scrolls that tries to be a bit more what's it grounded, but you know kind of gritty-ish. But then there's like where in this world prisons don't exist because people are all good, you know. I don't know. Apart from the evil Hitler guy who brought back the murder genie. Sorry, I was taking a drink there. This stream is brought to you by Orange Lucasade. Fresh fish, uh, they will spoil unless kept on ice. What? It's okay, I got some premium. No, it was just fresh water. I've not got the premium water. Oh, Gore can open this. The log seems like a switch that it can be pushed by a weapon. There we go, and go go back in the corner, cause you're I should try and make him useful, shouldn't I? I feel kinda bad. But it might be like Jal and just randomly have a bit where they become really useful. It's just the weapon's not like he's not got the damage output that I need. Oh fuck off! Let's let's actually try go against a mimic. Like, he's got the iframe with that, but the damage isn't. But his damage isn't as good as, like, say, Zhao's, or. Like, it's as good as them, if that makes sense. Which, when trading off the speed, isn't, isn't the best thing, you know? Like, I know I need to use him to level him up, but. When I've got much better characters, why would I use them if that makes sense, yeah? Who's just a slower Mikey who can do a big cool iframe attack? Right, there we go, there we go. Wait, right, I'm using that. And... How close are we to getting... Yeah, when we're about 40... We're 44 out of... How, wait, how... What was that? It was... 130. Throbbing Che, what's this? Pumped with energy. Class. I wonder if I can save the energy upgrade by just sitting about his Mikey and then every time there's a fight, just going straight to. I'll try that. Switch to Zhao whenever there's a. whenever enemies appear. I guess folk can't carry anymore. What do I. I'll bin some soap. I've got a lot of soap. And what have we got? That's what uh, EV is, I'll sell that. Because the bait actually sells for quite a wee bit. I just can't be fucked with a fishing minigame in this. Mikey can't jump this. Maybe Zhao can. Whoops. There we go, do a flip. Yes, man. And straight back to Mikey. So we save her stamina buff. Getting thirsty. Well, what's in here? Let's make some room by drinking some tasty water. Fuck me, it uses up most of my. That's. I thought it'd be like four things that fill up, but not filled up everything. I got a flapping fish. I think I'll sell that. Unless it's something. I need. Wait, no, that might be. Right, let's try this. That might be a thing I use to like unlock the secret areas, maybe. Oh my god, the damage on this is unreal. I wonder if I've got something that can give me a stamina boost, because that, I could make boss fights a fucking cakewalk. And turn most enemies into jokes. Like, look at that, I just killed a gunny in three shots. God damn it. Right, uh, bin some soap. Oh, I've got some tasty water. Delicious. Actually, I do need some water, so. And that'll use up another thing so I can open up a bunch of chests around here. Because there's plenty of cheese that are just waiting to get opened up.
Okay, I'll take a break after this one and just sell a bunch of stuff. Because I think we're running low on... Actually, no, I don't... I think we need some water, but... Still got Mikey and Goro that look fucking soap. That's a mimic, but that's okay. Mimic means extra points, isn't it? If I can actually hit it. Because these ones are pains in the arses. There we go. Do a wee bouncy. Wait, you, are you a mimic? Let's find out. You are not a mimic, that's probably an egg or something. That's a map. Are you the egg? Bag is full. Bin the soap. I got a carrot, oh boy. I really hope it fit that there's not like a main bit that's tied to fishing. I feel I'm fucked. Like, I remember I tried uh, to do when I got near replicant six fucking. Seven, eight, whatever, whatever the you know numbers are, the remake in year, which because I played in year ages ago, but I just done the like the main bit, and I was like, ah, oh, cool, happy that. But when I got Replicant, I was like, oh, let's try and finish the game. Let's actually try and do every quest available. And there was the fishing one, and I just went, no, nah, I can't do it. I'm terrible at any fishing mini game or any fishing story or whatever. Like I know there's a really cool side quest in Final Fantasy 15 tied to fishing. But I just can't do it. Same with Stardew Valley, like I need to finish all the the community centre, but I just can't do the fishing. I'm trying to visit any game that I RuneScape. But then again, RuneScape's just click and wait. Right, do I have a cabin key or I don't remember picking one up. There it is. Oh, skeleton waiting right there for me. But wait, I can two shot a skeleton? Fucking hell. There we go. What's this blue thing here? Oh, it's an upgrade. What are we getting? Ah! I'm just constantly getting fucked by the, the power ups. On the off chance that I might get a wee stamina boost. Even though there's like no enemies left here. I was gonna say, you know what, we'll leave this, but I want the upgrade points. Oh, I see. Can't shoot over one of the Actually, I'm just gonna check so how many I've still got some of that, and I've got some water. Yeah, we'll go in our we'll go in our level in the dungeon. There we go. What have we got in the chest? What have we got? A wee antidote drink. I got a hook so I can leave. Please be a mimic. Can't believe I'm saying that, but oh no, it'll be the egg. Oh boy, look at everything that I've not done. There's one chest at the back. But I think that she no, that just won't be the egg. That'll be. Let's find out what this. What's in the wee chest? The mimic. I knew it. Oh no! Ah, mimics hit hard. I'll munch some cheese as well once we get to the. Can cats have cheese? Actually, you know what we'll do as well, right? So I'm going to munch some cheese. And I'm going to give this a try. I'm going to see if this is what I do. Do I add a flapping fish? Oh my god! Uh, A junior chief appeared. Trust the junior, I guess so. Oh my god, this is terrifying. This is awful. I hate this. So you jump in the anglerfish's mouth. And he's got his gub open. I'm fucking drowning right now. This is awful. And then he just spits me out here. Yes, man. Vore the fuck at me. Oh, no, never mind. 
mask of Rant. Oh my god. Actually blocking me. I need to actually use a strategy on this thing and oh my god the health on that. Fuck. I got a turquoise. I got Amnethus. I'm just gonna run through it because these enemies are fucking solid. And that'll be like a super mimic or something like that. Mellow banana. Right, I'm just gonna run down here. And what have we got? Come on, give me some cool, give me a cool weapon or Sky Hunter. Cool. Nothing here. And those masks hit hard. Well, I don't even know if they are. Transfer broken to spirit. Okay, I'll go equip another one. I've got two of them, I think. Oh, another two. So I think I bought three. That's our mask. Oh boy, soap. What is that, Sam? Sam looks like fucking Kamen Rider, what the fuck? Stop stop blocking, it's cheating. I don't block you. <laughs> right, here we go. Oh, fuck me, he is like he is. Pure shonen boy. Throwing fireballs at me and shit like that. I'm gonna try and kill Sam. I don't think I can get away with killing the masks. Plus they're scary. Sam won't be a pal. Let me hit you. Come on, Sam. Right, Sam's dead. No fucking with any of these boysies. I don't know if I should just leave it or if I should try and dig a bit deeper. Because I might get like a really good weapon for... One of the boysies. Fire. Right, there's water there as well, so I'll get a drink. I love the mask enemies, doesn't it? Right. A sea killer. Oh, that could come useful here. I'll grab water. For everyone. And then we'll just head back. It's turned out okay, actually, here. Right, and now we're just sprinting back. Because these mask enemies will fuck me up. Right, come on, shall we? got this. Just keep going, and... Right into the fish's gub. Oh, forget they respawn. Oh, I need to get the hook again, don't I? Fuck, I should have unlocked. I should have at least unlocked it and then. But at least I got cool upgrades. Oh no, we ignore him. Sorry, Chief. I guess this is a way of farming. It'll give me extra weapon shit. Right, I'll get that. And how far are we off the upgrade? Not far. About 20 odd points, right? Uh, where's it? Exit's all the way down here. Ah, so we'll run to some enemies on the way there. So could I effectively just farm here by like going in and out of the of uh, the chief? Oh, that sounds grim. But you know, going like in and out of the bonus area. 
Like, as long as I've got enough for repair powders and then, you know. Listen to me, cheese. Mimic fuck. Maybe they will I've not gotten to back this up, but maybe Mimic's the only chest that respawn. You know what? I'll kill, I'll kill these two enemies. And then we'll head down. Man, Zhao is so fucking powerful now. She's like the only character that's really went, became fucking amazing. Like, she was kind of shite in the first dungeon. But now she's just decided, oh, here, I'm suddenly fucking class. That's probably to the hook. I don't know if I should, uh, should leave the dungeon. Yeah, fuck it, I'll leave the dungeon temporarily. Sell some stuff, do a wee bit of healing, do a wee bit of item. Right, bandit slingshot plus nine. I'll customize and I'll give you attack plus one. Nope, we'll give you speed plus one. And we'll give you sea killer. Got so many sky hunters, fucking hell, right, uh Status break, oh yeah, so I can I can break weapon and turn it into a sensory which I can then use to that build up. It can be built into the following weapons. Items needed are in red. So I need to get Oh, so I need to upgrade it to that level before I can change it into Wait, can I change in the towns? I can't. Let's pop into the shop first. And then get selling and get buying. Right, so I'm gonna sell carrot. Rotten fish. Uh rot sell the rotten fish I guess. Sell throwing cherry. Sell the Evi. Sell soap. Soap. Mellow banana. Sell a banana because I can always buy cheese. It does the same thing. Oh, I thought I was. I'm soap, fuck. Uh, right, there we go. So, what I'll do is I'll buy a couple of water, some cheese, and the rest of it just. There we go, 59. So now I've got plenty of repair powders. I've got one space for, which is hopefully for a hook. But obviously I can do some inventory management as we go. But we'll save. How many times have we in dungeon? 32 times. So I feel like that isn't tied to like an ending. Like you only get a good ending if you go to a dungeon less than 50 times or some shit like that. I hope that's something that this game doesn't pull. I've got a feeling it won't, but I don't want to, you know, touch wood. It doesn't do that. Right, where are we now? We're in the sunken depths. Heading down to the Titanic. Let's fucking go, boys. The Titanic. I can't even fucking talk. Fucking hell. And then pop up here. I probably should just use the fast travel. That would be a lot quicker. That is a cool wee cutscene, so I'll forgive it there. And this seems like a really. Like. It's an excuse for a dungeon, but it feels in story such a weird way. Like, oh yeah, we keep all of our fucking, all of our merchandise in a sink, a sunken ship, which hasn't corroded, which hasn't broken down. Here we go, shipwreck. What's at the? Oh, nothing. Is this a level that I need to play as someone, or is it like a story mode? A story mode, a story bit. 
Let's find out. Oh, Zhao and you play Zhao then. Due to Mysterious Force, Zhao was summoned. That's okay, because Zhao's are my best character. Right, but we're looking for a hook. There's probably going to be nothing but mimics here. Just. Oh, repair powder. Class. Oh, I thought you were dead. I seen something bouncing up and I was like, oh, here we go, we're getting a fucking. Oh my god, this is, this is my nightmare, boys. It's literally Mimic Central. Every fucking cheese is gonna be a mimic. I'm never gonna trust Ethan ever again. Right, there we go, kill that mimic. And nothing, right? Not a single hook at all. No, it's. There we go, right, get that. Upgrade on. Well, not really an upgrade. Get that repair powder on. Oh, look, a real cheese. A rarity. Stand in powder. Actually, there's a cheese through here. How do I know it's not like it's not a mimic that I need to kill? Bag is full. Can't carry anymore. Maybe a hook though, so I can need to. I'll drink some tasty water, just to make some bag space. Actually, hooks don't drop from things like this, do they? No, but I do need that key. But the thing with, with this level is, the second I get that hook, I'm not going to try and stick about. Oh, I can upgrade the bandit slingshot. Uh, upgrade. Need uh hmm wait forty nine oh I see so I need three B I need is that zero B slain I'm not quite sure how this but but works but I'm sure we'll find out as we go. Right, I'm just gonna go straight for you and hopefully you'll drop a hook. Nope, but have you got a hook? Hope you like the A hey! sound because we're gonna be hearing a lot on this level. Actually, she's the character I've been using, so I gotta hear it a lot in general. I've just I just assume that every box I open now is a mimic. That's right, gonna be an egg. Pretty heavy on the other side, isn't it? Like, I just need to get the timing right when they're bouncing. There we go. Nay hook. But I've got a key to open it up. It's down this way. Nothing here. Literally just nothing, right? Uh, But the thing is, I'm saying all this bit, like the sort of repetitive nature is cosy, but see if I was playing like Persona Reload, they'd be like, oh fuck. Not Persona Reload, but like Persona 3. I'd be like, oh fuck, here we go, Mementos, you know? Or even my biggest problem with Persona 3, and Persona 3, Persona 4, which is my favourite game of all time, is the repetitive nature of the dungeons. Even though they do jazz them up with like a little bit of background music, new music, and some gimmicks, you know? Overall, they can be quite repetitive, you know? Like they're definitely much better than the ones in uh, Persona 3. Wait, uh, what can I use? Ah, uh, fuck it, just throw the wind gem, I guess. Oh, it's a Drans Feather. That's actually really useful. Because I need to kill all these mimics because one of them might drop uh, the hook. There we go. Bag is full. Uh, munch up. No, shell. Just use some repair powder. Because I was going to waste the cheese if I just used it there. 
But I've got the hook. So now, where's... You know what, I'm just going to run from this. I'll do, let's do my weapon up while I'm... Mimic Breaker and... Amnethist, I guess. Don't know what Amnethist does again, but I got it from that place, so hopefully it'll be good. Attach a pulley to the hook and use a pulley to go up. There we go. Now what level are we on? We are on level... I want to say 6, I want to say. Level 6, I'm to... I get thirsty quicker. Oh. Well, it's okay. I'll speed, speed run through it. Of course. Good thing I'm not using that sword, which also makes you thirsty quicker. That'd be a fucking nightmare. But there is Atla on this level, so... I need to spend as much time here as possible. I just need, oh, basically, I just need to get all the Atla. Rooty. But the good thing is the, wa uh, the water up there. Also, it'll heal me, but I'll, ki I'll kill this roots first. And what have we got here? Give us a map. Maps are okay. I prefer the egg, but I'll take a map. Ah, fuck off. Oh, got some repair powder. Class. And an on our Dran's feather. Right, just get a wee drink. Make sure everyone's full of thirst. And Jal's just got to fly through the rest of this. Should I do... I'll do it in here first. Oh, there's not... What's that? A Goyon? What is it? He's kind of like a... Armoured fish. He's kind of like a Murloc. Oh, hey, boysies. So I've started playing World of Warcraft again, but I'm playing a private server called Solocraft. Which is kind of like vanilla Warcraft. But you can spawn in bots that will help you with missions and shit like that. That are workers like party members. And I'm enjoying it so much, boysies. Like, it is so cool just revisiting it, you know. And the fact that I don't have to play with anyone. Class, I know Final Fantasy fourteen does something similar. And Guild Wars obviously has the sort of mercenary system. Which is very simple, but I fucking love Guild Wars 1. Every, every time it's on sale on Steam, I'm always tempted to pick it up. I'll get it one day. And I might for... Because it's still got a campaign, and... And the campaign's actually pretty good, so I might run through it on, Steam, uh, on stream, you know? But Guild, Guild Wars is, 1 was my jam. played World of Warcraft a lot when I was younger. And then in between breaks of World of Warcraft, like, whenever I didn't have enough money, I'd usually go to, onto RuneScape. And RuneScape's fucking class as well, but I don't... I don't need to tell you, boysies, that RuneScape's class. Right, I used Goro to open this. Right, I'm back to Zhao. Oh, just hit the key on through here. How is he swimming when there's no water? Wait, oh, I can two-shot a skeleton now? Fucking hell. Yes, man. Zhao's becoming OP as fuck. Right, fountain. Here we go, boys. We got this. There's another Atla here, isn't there? Right, come on, give us something good. Give us something good. Oh, fucking our prison. What is wrong with this place that it needs so many prisons? Right, are we getting another prison or some shit like that? Jake. Cool, right, uh... 
Get in the outer boysies. Bag is full, can't carry anymore. You know what, skeleton? Let's, let's try and get Mikey some XP so he doesn't lag behind too much. Jarl's the best one against the Curse Rose because the thing's only got like this much. Oh, I don't want to risk uh, trying the auto one. I'm sure it works, but I get I just get nervous thinking like I don't want to ruin my item, you know? Oh fuck, the Gion got hit on me. I'll just stay out of anti goo amulet. I wonder if I have something I can like upgrade, I can like keep on me and it lowers my chance of getting poisoned or, or not poisoned, getting goo on me. You just need a good wash pal, you don't need an uh, amulet for that. Rooty store. I guess merchant town, so I guess everyone would have store of it. Let's take some premium water. And it puts me up to full. Might as well, what's in the box? Oh, power up powder. Actually, I'll, I'll wait and I'll give it to Mikey. Because that puts her level up by one. Because uh, I don't want Mikey lagging behind too much. Goro is fucked in her hand. I shall use that now. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's, let's keep Goro. Let's make Goro not lag behind. Let's give him the... Level up powder. There we go, we've upgraded his weapon a bit. Can we give it another level up powder? Ah, then we've just got some bread. Yeah, I'll munch the bread now. It won't heal all my health, but... Might as well, you know? Right, and we've, what have we got here? Cursed Rose. Which is such a, such a PS2 style. I get a big bang of uh, you go for big memories looking at it. I know that was like a PS1 title, but it just looks like an enemy to be in that. You know, a game I never played. I never played the sequel to uh, Forbidden Memories, which was called was it Jewels to the Roses, which takes place in fucking the War of the Roses in England. Never ever played that. Always wanted to, cause I always stare at it in like game or, but it was always too expensive. It was like tw it was always like twenty quid, you know, or like it never really dropped in price. Fuck it, wait, no. There we go. Finally counted them. Right, what have we got? It'll be the egg, won't it? Yes, man. Look at that. Might as well just take you down. I'll drink, I'll get a drink of water after I, there we go, drink of water and some repair powder. It's a long journey back to the, back to the other water. Right, and then we'll grab this Atla and then just make our way back. Pillar. Cool, Mikey's a bit thirsty, but you know what, just to try and... I just want to see if they do it. They all move about the same speed. Just their animations are different speeds, so it looks like you're moving slower or you're moving faster. Right, come on Goro, you got this. And here we go, Boozy's right. There we go, get Goro a heal. Get Jawa heal. Get Mikey a heal. Actually, Goro's weapon uh, endurance is massive. So I think Goro's whole point is using that fucking. What you call it? Charge attack. The one that he just no clips the enemies with. Next floor, fuck it. Might as well. So this will be floor seven. If I can get to ten, I'm happy. 
Oh fuck, Sam's back. He's not as powerful as what he was. What? I wonder why you'd look at an enemy like that and think, oh here, Sam. It just gets scalping. Remember Sam was fucking... What is it? Not, not Kamen Rider's the wrong way. It looks like Giver. Oh, he's meant to be ice-themed. I see. Has anyone ever seen the Giver movie? Weird as fuck. It's got Mark Hamill in it and on the cover, they clearly made it look like Mark Hamill was the main character, but he's not. Mark Hamill's a detective who's work who's like trying to find out who the Giver is. But then gets killed in a really horrible way. He gets turned into like a bug monster and then murdered. But the advertising made you want to think that Mark Hamill was the Giver. I've only seen the Giver once on like a sat on the sci-fi channel. But I did have Giver Dark Hero on uh, DVD. I think I've still got it sitting somewhere. I'm just gonna i fly over here. Fucking scalped Sam there. Yes, man. And what have we got up here? Oh, enemies. They're going. I'm just going to bullet hell you into next week. Man, it really, I feel really bad for some enemies because it's just not fair. Zhao's just too powerful. So she does need some. Does need some upgrade powder. Which? Oh, not upgrade powder. Repair powder. Wait, what is this? Anti gun. Put it some goo. Will rip after extensive use. Put it there. A ship cabin key. Ooh, okay, well, that's useful. Right, and then switch over to Mikey. Right, what have we got? What have we got? Road. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna just sprint through the rest of these levels. I'm gonna try and get to 10. That's my goal for the stream. Or whenever we get a sort of story segment, you know, like 10 or 9 or whatever, you know. Sheriff's office, cool. Fucking Mikey says A cab. Let's repair your sword because it's getting on the weaker side. And then at the end of the stream, we'll just do like a bunch of building, like. Right, and then do a big flip. Yes, man. Right, there's a wee bit I need to explore down there. Let's just kill this gunny first. You know what, I thought like when you have to buy your own repair part, I was like, oh, the game's got to get really stingy, it's got to be really tough. Not really, money isn't really an issue. Like, you can, like, the smallest thing you get... Oh, I got Sam. Like, the smallest bit of money you get is enough to cover... Right, does anyone need anything? Uh... Oh, I'll put some repair powder on your weapon just to... Just make some space in the inventory. This might be something cool, might be something important. Never mind, it's a petite fish. Never mind. It's getting sold. Oh, shit, I wasn't paying attention. I just wandered right into that uh, fish man. Right, just kite him. Just kite him. Kiting is a term like, I'm, I'm really, I picked up from Warcraft where you hit an enemy and then run slightly away. But it's still, it's still aggroed towards you and then you drag it to a certain bit. I also remember there was this big final boss, he was like a, I can't remember his name, it was something like, it was something ridiculous like Xantros the fucking unliving or whatever, and he's like this big demon, and he wandered around this world, he wandered around this area, and uh, this area was like, big barren wasteland, so it was like, ah oh, it's cool, you can wander about here, it's fine. 
but I remember someone kited them all the way to like the main city and uh, the main human city in Warcraft, which is the biggest uh, alliance city, and he went in a fucking murdering spree. Right, here we go, here we go. Thing is, I've got such love for like old Warcraft and but I'm not like one of these ones like I stopped playing after Crusade, uh, not Crusade, after Cataclysm. But it w and now I went I tried the free trial now. And fuck me, it's a completely different game. And I'm not I'm not one to be like, oh back in my day it was better, but it's just so different and just like they throw levels at you now, you know, it's mental. But I think that's because now all their content that they're bringing out is new stuff that you can only do at like level, whatever the max level is now, you know. So they just want to get you from A to B as quick as possible. And I think looking back, I think a lot of a lot of stuff I liked in Warcraft was the community was a whole emergent gameplay. Is that is that a term? That's definitely a term, right? It was stuff that the game they they didn't. That they didn't put in it was stuff that just naturally happened in the game if that makes sense while nowadays it's very this is how we want you to play if that makes sense and you'll play it our way it's kind of like the grand theft auto online like see gta 4 online you just kind of got put in a box and went right, do what you want and there wasn't like mission there was some missions to do. there was like three or four missions to do, to do. But most of it was just a sandbox and just, yeah, play around in it. And me and my pals had a fucking great time in that. While well, GTA 5's online is like, right, so you've got missions, you've got money, you can't do it until you get up more money, so you need to build up your stuff, you need to build up your, you know, criminal empire. And I was like, I just want to steal a car and block off a bridge and see if my pals can break it with, you know, with our cars. Because that's the kind of shit that we used to do, you know? Because like, GTA 4 something was kind of like, right, just on you go to have fun however you want, you know? While GTA 5's one's like, you have fun the way we want you to have fun, you know? Anyways, I'm ranting about back in my day, my, 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 you know? But I guess you can't monetize that as much. Right, uh, where's the hook? I'm just going to double check, I've got all the Atla, I do have all the Atla. Next level. Let's fucking go, boys. And I've got enough escape powder that I can just use that to get out if I'm a bit... If I'm a bit ahead of myself, if you get what I mean. Like, over my head, that's what I meant. Not over my head. I don't know the word. If I'm getting a bit too excited and just get destroyed by things, right, I hear sounds. Sam! You're back. No, let's try Goro here. Right. Oh no! I right, see, I frame an attack works pretty well. The damage that Sam can put out is not Sam Goro. Let's get Mikey out so he can open up this Atla. Sunshade. How done for time warp? But yeah, fuck it. We'll definitely get to like level ten. Still got at least twenty-five minutes of stream. Because we'll get as far as we can and then we'll sit and we'll, for the last wee while on stream, we'll just build. Right, open that up. There we go, as long as it doesn't block, we're good. Please don't block, Sam. Just make things a lot easier for me. I've got that egg. Ooh, that's a... There's a lot of things I need to still get over for there. And we're on level 8 right now, aren't we? Oh no! Oh 
Oh, I just forgot to block block onto Sam there. I just need to wait until he's so Oh, I can get him now when he's doing his attack. Big Giver looking motherfucker, right? Uh switch over to Mikey. Got a lamp. Yes, my Mickey loves lamp. I, I never ever played uh, Dark Chronicle, mainly because I didn't know it was a sequel to Dark Cloud. I remember seeing it. I had plenty of times I could have bought it, but I'd always pick up something else instead. But it's one of the games I'm always, I, I'm looking forward to digging into. I wonder if it's more... Is it more like Dark Cloud? Because I love the the uh, world building thing. It reminds me, reminds me a lot of... Did anyone ever play a game on the Super Nintendo called Act Razor? So Act Razor is a really cool game. It's really hard, but it's kind of like a... Like a 2D sort of... Ghouls and Ghosts thing. It's not, it's not as hard as Ghouls, Ghouls and Ghosts or Ghosts and Goblins, whatever it's called. But it's kind of similar gameplay to that, you know? But then the other half of the game is... You're building this world, because you're like the avatar of this god. And you're trying to bring the world back to what it was. Kind of similar to Dark Cloud in a way, you know? I can upgrade the ban the slingshot again. Can't build it up yet. I oh, fuck off, there's a lot of enemies in this room, so I need to be careful I don't wander into one of them. Right, a Sam over there just throwing Hadoukens at me. Or, I, I, I was going to say Ice Hadoukens who throws them, but there was a character in Street Fighter 5 who was like ice-based. I forget her name. I think she was the... Was it Ed that was the... There was Ed that was a clone of Bison, I believe. And she might have been the... I forget her name. Street Fighter 5 had... It had some cool characters in interest, but I think overall the roster was a bit... Well, actually, not a, not actually she never had a good roster. Street Fighter 5 ended up being a really good game, but it just launched in a horrific state with, like, no content. Like, see if you can get Street Fighter 5 now and like, a complete edition on sale. Pick up, it's fucking class. You, play, you, can, get, you can play as Gil, my boy. Who's possibly my favourite boss in a fighting game. Because he looks so unique. Like, it's an arsehole when you're fighting him. And he goes, Resurrection. But it's really fucking hype. Really hype, you know? It feels like you're in the middle of an anime. That like you've just fucking thrown everything at him. And you're all fucked. And then suddenly, Resurrection, he's back up full health. You're like, oh fuck, here we go. Let's fucking do this. Anyway, what are we getting? Pumping energy. And what are we pumping? Uh, again. And sometimes, like, see if you play especially the the arcade edition, girls are input reading piece of shit. But yeah, I love me. There's a reason, he, there's a reason when ever we do the tournaments in uh, Mugen Fight Night, girls are my boy that I always choose to represent me. He never wins. Right, uh, on, I'm just gonna, gonna bend the flapping fish because I'm not gonna take the. My, my voice just broke there, holy shit. I've not got a large cheese in ages. I know it's random, but fuck me, it's been bad. Oh, King's Hideout. Oh no. I couldn't see because of the camera there. Make it just block. Come on, Mikey, you got this. Listen to his wee feet. There we go. Scalp that mimic. Scalp it. Then change to Jal to do a wee flip. I think that's everything. Up oh, transfer, broken, disappeared. So it's a good thing I picked up because I bought another one and I found another one. I think. There's one there. Oh, fuck me, I've got four. 
That's probably why we're flying through these dungeons, just because I've been very lucky and just got so many of these Dran feathers. Right, where's the hook? Where is the hook at? There it is. Yeah, fuck it. One more. At least one more. I'll have a look at my inventory, see how we're doing for items and shit like that. Oh! Story! Captain! Somebody's here! Hey, hey, hey! Any landlubber that trifles with my ship won't leave alive. Hey, all your hearties. Feed them to the sharks. Ah, uh, Cap, uh, he's over there. Ah, I knew that, you fool. Have you won? Not yet, we're just... We're... I don't want to say halfway through the shipwreck, but... How are you doing, Michael? How's your day going? I... Wait, are you not playing Wrestle Quest in like 10 minutes? I'm looking forward to watching that. I knew that, you fool. That way, feed them to the sharks. Oh, boss fight time. Right, I'll just kill the captain first. Because he's giving me... You better have uh, fucking Jeff Jarrett's My World team loaded up and just play it like bass boosted to fuck when he appears. Just a big bree woo bree woo. Oh, fuck. Right, uh... Some cheese. I've said this before, but can you feed... Uh, Cat's cheese. You prob probably can, I don't know. Oh god. And then just. Sit. Oh no! I thought I dodged that. Genuine fear and worry there. Small amounts. Ah, fair enough. It's very salty. Oh shit. You know what, this. Oh fuck me. Just beating that. Right, and then just. Feed this wee cat even more cheese. There we go. And what have we got here? Got the hook to go onto the next floor. Yes, man, here we go. We are. Oh! There's a crystal with a red beam. Maybe it has something to do with opening this door. A crystal with a red beam. I've got a feeling this is when the new character pops out, but we're going to have to head back because we can't do anything here. No sign of monsters so we can just teleport it. Now it's time for the fun part, well, fun-ish part, we're just going to build all the shit that we found. Just need to get into, get over here and whenever I can, oh I need to actually go up the stairs because like a separate instance, isn't it? Here we go, let's get building. And then, I, hopefully one character will give me something that will lead to, you know, a new party member, because fuck me, I won't be able to open that. Or unless it's something really obvious and I'm just ignoring, which is also... also possible. Right. Rooty store. Put that there. Jack's store. And Joker's house. Yeah, I've not. I, what I might do is I'll put the houses over here and the shops there. King's hideout. There we go. Uh, sheriff's office. Um, here I guess. I said the area was massive. It's not the. Well, actually, I take it back. It's kind of big. Fountain. Put the fountain in the middle here. I think that's everything. Right, and... King, a rich man aspiring to be the mayor. Right, so you'd stay in King's hideout. Uh, Joker, shady owner of the crystal store. I assume you'd go there. Uh, car, a very unusual vehicle. I've got a feeling you might belong to King, because who else would afford? Knife wielding weapon shop. Right, who's who's that? Jack. Do I have Jack's store? I do have Jack's store. A store needs a sign. And a lamp, I imagine. A 
sunshade, maybe? Nope, that's not sunshade. Stu, King's Faller, Faller quick-witted. It was King's Hideout. There we go. And what have we got here? Righteous Sheriff with a great moustache. Oh, what a boy. The Sheriff's Office. Rooty, Fish Storekeeper. Pepe and Bouncy. Wait, have I got Ro I'm sure I've got Rooty's store. There's Rooty there. Sunshade, maybe? Nope. Who's this? Jake, King's Follower, strong. So that'll be like the... His muscle. Cool. And who else have we got here? Sam, boy, Wilder's deputy. Right, that's in the... The sheriff's office. Give them a sign. And um, what's this? A prison. Right, time to go talk to the characters to see what... What are you into? What do you want? Right, Jack's store. Oh, I got a bomb from Jack. Store's closed right now anyway. Right, Rooty, how you doing? Hey, brother, you're not from this town. Good to meet you. I'm Rooty. I own a fish store. I'm not open for business yet, though. So, brother, you're from Nolan. Don't think you can get fresh fresh fish there. I can't talk. Fresh fish there. I have three fish baskets. You thought it was two, didn't you? Don't forget now. Hey, he wants fish baskets. I've got, I've got three actually. Yeah, we can f put them here. Push cart, a bit fishy. Right, there we go. We've got finished Rooty's store. Let's go get a, a wee event with Rooty. Hi, how may I help you? The store's reopened today. Lots of fresh fish here. Why don't you buy some? Ah, that's right. You're my first customer. I'll give you a special discount price. Here. A flapping fish. Which uh, opens up the secret areas. Make sure to keep it cold or it'll get rotten. Always place it next to Eif if you keep it in a bag. Eif? Ice if you keep it in a bag. I'll give you some free ice for today. Also, I literally put it in my bag next to ice. Make sure to buy from me from now on. I'll give you the best price. Right, and then Durama parts. Wait, is Jack in? That's a, that's a wall, no wonder I couldn't see him. Can I get into the shop? Have I put it all the way around? Actually, have I put, do I even have Jack? He should be cutting about somewhere, but wait, I've not got a door to his annex room separate from the store. I'm gonna save that because maybe wait. Uh, let's go. Let's go to King's Hideout first. Because this place is massive. Can't exit. Can't enter there. Let's try the front door. Maybe the front door. That's probably a better shout, isn't it? Oh, it's now the morning. Right, uh, anyone? There's King there. Eh, this is no good. Commoners don't just walk in and talk to Mr. King. Uh, wouldn't need them for your place. Don't forget my car. Don't you love that sleek body? Not bad, right? Right, fine then. Looks like you can't open it. Right, so he wants his car. But I'll need to find his goons that are cutting a bit so I can ask them. Right, somebody's down there. It's Jake. I never saw you before. I'm Jake. I'm with Mr. King, the dawn of the town. Don't forget it. Right, need anything for your place? Hey, didn't forget Sunshade. It's important. That's the sheriff, I think. Hmm, I never saw you in town before. Are you from our town? Hmm, you're from Nolan Village. I have a relative living there. I'll tell you about it some other time. My name's Wilder. I'm a sheriff of Queens. If you need something, you can ask me anytime. I always help the citizens. Need anything for your place? Even though this town appears to be peaceful crimes occur, I need at least two prisons. Jesus Christ. There's like six people that live here. Well, you must be from out of town. Let me introduce myself. My name is Stu. Not like Chunky Stu, like just Stu. 
Even if it's something small as, as a lamp, I've put it in the house. Cool, right. Anyone else cutting about? Got some tasty water. Right. I've talked to talked to Jake as well, haven't I? Yeah. I got a holy gem. Okay, I can finish King's Hideout, I think. So I need the uh, car, a lamp, and a sunshade. Right, I gotta finish King's Hideout. Fucking Jesus! The size of that thing. That is ridiculous. How the fuck do you drive that? Hey pal, how you doing? Still seems like someone's at the door. Could it be the boy who restored my gorgeous mansion? Yes sir, it seems so. Yikes, so he's come? Ah, could be coming asking for money, Matt. Money, money and more money. Probably. That's no good, no good at all. Wait, I've got an idea boss. Da. What, King Billy and a boy? Can you imagine the bad press? No, no, no. You don't want bad rumours before the election. Ah, what do we do? Boss? Eh? Whispering. Oh! That's it. We still have that option. That's quite a... I don't want to be involved with that. No worries. It'll be okay. It's a two for one deal. Oh, Alright. Wait, what's the two for one deal? What's going on here? Ah! So you're the kind lad that completed my house for me, eh? Indeed you are. Ah yes, Mikey, right? How can I help you today? Oh no, no need to tell me everything. I get a picture. Wait over there. Uh, we'll get you something you need. Something special. What are we getting? Oh, oh no, I don't, whatever it is, Mr. King, I don't want it. Oh, it's a lamp. Um, Mikey was your name? You see, in this world there are things so valuable that they're invaluable. In other words, there are things that money can't buy. And this is one of them. Here you go, an appreciation of your hard work, please take it. Eh? You tell me you don't want it? Why? If you don't have a good reason, then you must accept it. You don't want to embarrass King by going without letting me return the favour? Then please accept this and be on your way. Fine, I guess I'll take this and fuck off. Oh, I dropped it. Huh? Oh! Are you telling me you've had a lamp for ages and you've never tried rubbing it? Oh! Oh, hello! Boys, I found my new favourite character. How can I serve you, King Darling? Uh, nope, 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 it wasn't me. I haven't done anything. Oh, I see. It's not you this time, huh? That's no fun. So, it's you guys this time, and how can I serve you? No, 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 it's not me. I don't know anything. What? It, no, it couldn't be. You called me for no reason. That's not good, not good at all. So we've got a badass genie It's just fucking people up. Yes, man. King darling, I sense it in the air lately. Every time I come out, you seem upset. Or is it just my imagination? Upset? Me? No, never. Don't be silly. You never up upset me, really? Then say my name out loud. Come on, with feeling. And she's called Ruby. Our new favourite character, uh, the great genie Ruby. Yeah, that's a spirit, but you know my greatness already. So why do you, don't you go and call up my greatness and uh, majesty for no reason? Oh, uh, well, actually, he called you. Oh, Mikey's terrified. Ah, so you're the one, the boy everyone's talking about, going around fixing the world. Well, that's awesome, and there's no music. And this dark genie has caused this mess that powerful? Or that powerful? Ah, see. Stronger than me? Hmm. Okay, I've made up my mind. I'm in. I'll fight that dark genie with you. Just give me a, a holler when you need me. Hey! Find my new favourite character, boysies. Ruby has become an ally. Yes, man. 
Big waifu energy, let's fucking go. Oh! Oh, no, I thought it was snowing, never mind, it was just a... So I imagine Ruby's gonna open up the next area for us. But let me just finish this where we go. And it's Sam that we're looking for. Maybe if I pop into the... If I pop in, he'll be inside. Mimic Breaker. Maybe Ruby's the one that uses magic then. Oh, there's Sam there. Hi, you don't look like you're from around here. But this is a good town, so make yourself at home. My name's Sam. I'm a Sheriff Wilder's assistant. Good to meet you. I had need for your place. Please place my patrol bicycle outside. Oh, he's got a wee bicycle, so he does. That's good news, because we've also got a bicycle that we need to use. Actually, I need to go in edit mode, don't I? And then we'll finish the Sheriff's office as well. I didn't get a wee event there. Hi, Mikey. This is Sheriff's The Sheriff's office will resume operations starting today. The town's safety is in good hands. Come inside, the Sheriff's waiting. Oh, he's got a big fucking shotgun. Can I have a shotgun? That'd be, that'd be easy. It'd be easier than having a sword. There you are, Mikey, right? You're the one who restored the town, aren't you? What an amazing young man you are. Amazing, isn't he? I'm Wilder, and I'll be glad to help you from now on. If you run into any problems, come to me. Moonorb? Hmm. I've never heard of it. Sorry, I can't help you with that. Sheriff, Joker might know something. Joker? The Joker who sells crystals? Yes, sir, he's been acting funny lately. The wor word is that he's running around the town to find some rare crystal. I see. He's the kind that does anything for money. Probably trying to stock up on some weird items. Mikey, that Moonorb's sort of like a crystal, right? Joker might know something about it, you should go see him. What, you haven't met Joker yet? Hmm, I see. Okay, leave it to me. Sam? Yes, sir. Just a minute, please. Uh, try to make it fast. Here it is. Ah, thank you. Mikey, take this with you. If Joker gives you a hard time, show him this. He'll cooperate after that. Search warrant. Oh. See you, Mikey. Take care. So maybe Joker won't mention talk to me. Unless I've got that key item in the search warrant. You know what? I'll fucking just toss the petite fish out. Allows entry to Joker's store. Attack plus two. Glass. Bag is full, can't carry anymore. Ah, you know what? We've got plenty of stuff in there. We don't we, we don't need whatever that is. Actually, I've not been to the shops yet, have I? So I'd, how's my items looking? Yeah, I'll be fine. Because I'm pretty sure I've done a shop just before we dived into the... We've got Joker's house, but we've not got anything for Joker. Got a lamp. Got sunshade, a sign, and a chimney. There we go, finished Joker's house. Hopefully we can go up and then... This Jack's store. Joker's house, there we go. Now because i got a search warrant, I can actually get in. The store's closed today, go home will you? What? You have a warrant? Damn, Wilder's gone too far. Well, come in already. Right, Ruby's gonna fucking break your knees. Mon, what, what do you want from me? I'm busy, I have no time to play with children. Moonorb, what's that? What makes you think I know such a thing? Let me ask you one thing. What kind of thing is this moon orb? I can't believe you're such a fool for looking for something you know nothing about. Do you know what I am looking for now, boy? You want to know, don't you? Then let me tell you. It's called the Life Sphere. He who possesses the sphere is supposed to be granted eternal life. It's a legendary sphere. I'm sure it's somewhere here in Queens. 
It's just that the sphere contains fearful magical power. It's said that he who holds it in his hand will have eternal life, but lo will lose his most precious possession. Well, of course, the most precious thing to me uh, other than your life. I heard it came around here a hundred years ago, but nobody knows what happened after that. Exciting story, eh? I'm gonna find it. When I get it, the only thing I'll be uh, I'll lose is gonna be this store. I think I've got an idea where to... Uh, nothing, forget. Well, looks like I already said too much. Somehow, I don't feel like you're a stranger, though. Let's be friends, huh? We're both looking for the same thing. I sell nothing but these useless crystals. Come buy some anytime. Hey, you, you're here. Make yourself at home. Fruit of Eden acquired. Ooh. Shall we use the Fruit of Eden first? Who will give the health upgrade to? I'll give it to Zhao. What's Ruby's health like? 90? If I give it, give it to Ruby. Right, uh, was that the event? I'm just gonna check. That was the event. Cool, right. Right, so he's got all these fire, what, fire gems and stuff like that. Sell him some ice gems back to him. It's a silly useless ship we've got. Just that, I'll keep the, fr the fish fresh. Right, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. what have we got? It's useless. I don't think we've got anything else that's useless. Right, let's head out. Where else do we go? What else can we do? I'll have a look at the Georama part, see if there's anything else that we can try and fix. Jack store. Right, I'll go talk to Jack, see if there's anything else that he needs. I've done kings, I've done sheriffs, I've done jokers. Right, let's pop in, see if there's anything I can use here, or anything that he needs. Who are you? You're from out of town, huh? So I'll introduce myself. I'm Jack. I own this fine weapon shop you see before you. Have a look around. Uh, do you need a fair place? Don't forget the shades and the chimney. They're important features. Right, uh, let's go do that. So a chimney and a... And like a sunshade. What have I got? Chimney. There we go. And I'll be able to finish Jack's store as well. Class. There we go. Let's pop in here, do the wee event thing, and then... There you go, the weapon shop's open. Oh, but Jack's away. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Hey, Mikey. Thanks to you, I can reopen my store. Drop by Jack's store for weapons, big and small. Oh, just so you know, I don't give gifts or anything like that. Just don't get your hopes up. Oh, but Ruby's gotta fuck him up. What? I get it. I was expecting something like that. That voice? And he's shaking. Yes, man. Ruby, the boss's wife. What are you doing here? What brings me here? What a thing to say after such a long time. Hmm. You know, it's important to show proper gratitude. If not, well, it could be like that. I might start getting upset. I, I I understand, Miss Ruby. And a, anything you need, it's yours. Why don't you come up with something? You've got a. Why don't you come up with something? You've got a brain, don't you? Use it. Uh, yeah. Understood, Miss Ruby. Wait here just a second. Yes, my big wife through energy. So I'd keep you waiting, Miss. What? What's that? Big Buck's Hammer. Oh, that's for my boy. For Goro. It's for you, Miss Ruby. It's a platinum ring. Hmm. Very common, isn't it? Ah, it'll do for now. This is it for today. We make he's terrified. Right, let's give Goro that weapon. 
Alright, wait, I've got two more characters to get. Holy shit. Gold ring, platinum ring. Oh, so her, her one's all about like what attribute she's got. I see. Oh. And then where's Goro? Let's see how good this big box hammer is. Fuck me, that's quite a jump. Right, and I think... Fountain, what's the fountain got? Water surface, spout, and a pillar. There we go boys, I've finished the fountain. Is that absolutely everything that I've... Yep, there we go, that's, that's everything that I've got here. Let's, uh, what we'll do is we'll... How are we doing time-wise? About six minutes. Ah, fuck it, we'll go to the shipwreck, we'll do... Another level. At least one more. So we've got a good headway and next time we can just try and finish the shipwreck. Because I've done quite a lot of this stream. Layer 9. Oh yeah, because... I did say 10 was where I wanted to go. Let's try Ruby. Right, so I've got the hook. What's this? There's a crystal with a red beam, maybe we'll wrap some spell. Wait, red beam? Red, oh I see. Huh. I have no clue. So I have mine a boot that I can use to <laughs> Right, I'm gonna look at I'm gonna just gotta check up. Color beam will tell you what you need to do. Uh, oh, never mind. Firstly, you need to put. I didn't know there was a first person mode. And if it's red, then I assume fire. Yes, man, getting all fucking Elden Ring here. Not Elden Ring. Eternal Ring. The better of the the E Ring games that from Software. Brought out. There's a pulley system that seems to have some function, so if I then use this, attach the pulley to hook, go to the upper level, here we go. We'll do one more floor, just to see how Ruby is. Right, layer 10, here we go. There's a crystal with a yellow beam. I've only got... Oh, I might have to go get a... I might have to go get a lightning ring or something like that from the armor shop or something like that. I mean, you can fly, can't you? Okay, we'll explore this and then we'll leave. Because worse comes to us, we get a wee bit of weapon XP and get uh, some items. Oh, I need to get some gourds for Ruby because she is. Oh, fuck me, right, okay. Just sit in the water. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, okay, maybe this bit's... Maybe it's... I need to upgrade Ruby a little bit. Oh, 
Oh no, Mickey's got getting caught in the. Oh, my weapon's about to break. Well, let's try this. It works. Whew. I got a hook, but fuck it, I, I'm not going to be able to use it. Because I need to get that yellow ring for a ruby. You know what, I'm just going to go into the water here and get a wee heal. And then every time we fires, pop back into the water and... There we go. Easy peasy. Into the water we go. So we're not into the water. Actually, that's easy to just stand here and whenever I get hit, and I fall automatically fall into the water. Woo! That enemy's tough. Oh, there's a cheese back there I didn't open. But you know what, we'll get that Atla in there. Oh, I'm, there's not going to be Atla that I can't get. So yeah, we can't finish this stage until we get Ruby's Lightning Ring. But you never know, I might actually just wander up here and there might be a, a ring just lying on the floor somewhere, you know? Man, these chariot enemies are fucking... Are, I don't want to say they're hard, because they... They hit like a truck, but they're very easy to dodge. But the problem is, I'm an idiot. Like, look what I did there. Literally wandered into the firing line of one. It's okay. Easy enemies now with the cursed rows and shit like that. Actually, let's try Ruby with the... Oh, that's ice she's got now. Let's try to change to the gold ring, which is fire. Actually, I wonder if... Can I just change a tribute and... Uh... Holy devil. Do I have, like, I've got fire here? Let's... But do I have thunder? There we go. I can just change the tribute to say fire here. Oh, there we go, so I don't have to get a new item. Oh, fuck. Right, uh, let's get... Let's try Goro with his new hammer. Yes, man, we... His wee wandering feet. Let's go. I mean, you're gonna run out of place to run eventually. Oh, that sound. Okay, Goro's good now. There we go. Right, boys, we're getting thoroughly fucked up here, so let's escape back to... Actually, I can use the Dran Fair just to fly down here, can't I? And let's just fully heal everyone. So I can just change the attribute, that's cool. It's not like. It's not like I need to get a different ring. That's cool, that's. No, as bad. I, I just assumed that. Oh, I'm fucked, boys. Can I finish this stage? But I can, I can, we're good. So we'll finish this level and then we'll, that's when we'll call it quits. Right, let's ch change to Ruby and Weapon Attribute to Thunder. I should upgrade all of Ruby stuff so that... Right, that's opened up. And straight away we're changing to... We'll go to Zhao. Actually, it's... I think it's stuck on the, the bit up here. 
Oh, never mind, it's figure out the stairs. Right, scalp that enemy. Oh, another another bit of water. But I need to get some repair powder in there. Give me some repair powder, be a pal. Of course, soap. Monster is fuck. Oh my god. That's okay. The power up wore off. So that powered up the monsters, but luckily the the buff only lasted at a tiny, tiny bit. Right, so we've got two rooms left to do. We've got a chimney, class. Right, and no we'll go to Zhao, because Zhao. Zhao's probably the best character right now. I'm sure Ruby's going to overtake that eventually if it has the exit. A rusty key. Have I got a cabin key? I do not. Right, we'll get around to that. That'll probably be in one of the chests up here. There's a lot of chests there, so probably plenty of mimics as well. Oh, just look at that cabin key. Oh, it's because it's upgraded. It's got a stamina buff. Yes, man, I've got it trapped in a pattern. Yes, man, look at me, I'm the best. And fuck off, Gunny. We got this, boys, we got this. Yes, man. Your old dad is the best at video games. And the cat girl's the best character. Well, actually, no, let's change over to Ruby. The waifu. And change... Let's just try to go the fire ring. Okay, she does good damage. If I charge up an attack... Oh, she can't move when I charge up an attack. I mean, it does a little bit extra damage, but I might as well just do this. So as long as I keep a... Uh... Nope, wrong button. Right, so as long as I keep like an inventory full of like, you know, one each, then we're good. Because all I need to do is just change the attribute. And then occasionally level her up so she's got them. They don't need to be particularly good, you know? It's... As long as I've got them so I can open up doors. Got to get a wee drink first. Actually, we'll get everyone a wee, a wee heal, just in case they're on a bit of the health a wee bit low. And I'll give everyone a before we finish the stream. I'll he uh, peel up everyone's weapons with uh, repair powder. Right, a rusty keyhole. So use the use the ship cabin key. Here it is. Right, just spam him with fireballs. And big Hadouken. Big Hadouken. There we go. And repair powder on the ring. I shall change back to the platinum ring and change the attribute to ice. Because that's probably going to do the most damage. I mean, not to the cursed rose, but... Actually, no, no, it's doing not bad damage. Is it the closer I get? 31, 30... Fucking hell, so the closer I get, the more damage it does. So it's not like... Zhao's, uh... 34, 35. It's not like Zhao who just can fire things like Michigan. You can be still kind of close to them. Cool, right, I got that. And after we get this, we'll finish the... Finished the level. And that means we're finished level 10, so the next stream we can just barter through with uh, whatever's left. 
of the shipwreck, so we'll be probably I'll finish the shipwreck next. We've got a good thing going with like every two streams we finish a dungeon. We've got a good wee part going. First of all, let's heal. Let's get a wee heal and get a wee drink first. No point using up our our shit. And what I'll do while I'm here, just so I can quit as soon as we leave. Just give everyone. A wee bit of repair powder. Mike doesn't need it. Gel needs it though. There we go. And here we go. Use the hook. And use it to go to the next level. Let's fucking go boys. And we'll leave the dungeon temporarily. Because I think that's us on to 11 now. And I. Let's save just to be sure. Just to be careful. One more time. And one more time. So there we go, boysies. We've got a new party member. We've arrived in Queens and we've actually done quite a lot of work in Queens. So aye. We've done a crazy amount of work this stream. But aye, in the meantime, boysies, I'm going to head off. So I'm just going to head over. Everyone say goodbye to wee Mikey because we're going to head over to this screen. And I'm going to mute that. I need to find out a way to mute when I change screens. I'm sure it's easy. But make you can't figure it out. Anyway, boysies, uh, let me think. So tomorrow we'll be playing Tekken again. Not Tekken, sorry. Tenchu. I'm not quite sure what time. It'll probably be later on, but you can keep up with my times on my Discord. Uh, I am not streaming on Saturday, because I'm already wrestling in Bannockburn. But I will be streaming on Sunday, so Friday and Sunday, and then, um, again, more times on the Discord and stuff. I'm really enjoying Dark Cloud. We'll be back with Dark Cloud on Sunday. But I. Thank you so much for joining us, boysies. As usual, I've been Mikey. You guys have been absolutely fantastic. Hopefully I'll catch you on my next stream. But until then, boysies, have a good day. Have a fantastic rest of your week. Most importantly, boysies, have good mental health. We're going to be giving Mike what we read with, uh, with WrestleQuest. So aye, catch you over there. In the meantime, see yous.